In the name of Allah, the most merciful, the most compassionate, as does he in whose hand is the dominion of the universe and who has power over everything, who created death and life, that he might try you as to which of you is better indeed. He is the most mighty, the most forgiving, who created the seven heavens one upon another. You will see no incongruity in the merciful one's creation. Turn your vision again. Can you see any flaw? Then turn your vision again, and then again. In the end, your vision will come back to you, worn out and frustrated. We have adorned the lower heaven with lamps and have made them a means to drive away the Satans. We have prepared for them the chastisement of the blazing fire. The chastisement of hell awaits those who disbelieve in their Lord. What a wretched destination! When they will be cast into it, they will hear it roar as it boils, as though it will burst with rage. Every time a multitude is cast into it, its keepers will ask them, Did no warner come to you? They will say, Yes, a warner came to us, but we gave the lie to him and said, Allah has revealed nothing, you are surely in huge error. They will say, If we had only listened and understood, we would not be among the inmates of the blazing fire. Thus will they confess their sins. Damned are these inmates of the blazing fire. Surely, forgiveness and a mighty reward await those who fear Allah without seeing Him. Whether you speak in secrecy or aloud, it is all the same to Allah. He even knows the secrets that lie hidden in the breasts of people. Would He not know He who has created when He is all subtle, all aware? He it is who made the earth subservient to you, so traverse in its tracks and partake of the sustenance He has provided. To Him will you be resurrected. Do you feel secure that He who is in the heaven will not cause the earth to cave in with you and then suddenly it will begin to rock violently? Do you feel secure that He who is in the heaven will not let loose upon you a storm of stones? Then shall you know what my warning is like. Those who came before them also gave the lie to the messengers. Then how awesome was my chastisement! Have they not seen birds above them spreading and closing their wings, with none holding them except the Merciful One? He oversees everything. Which is your army that will come to your aid against the Merciful Lord? But the unbelievers are in utter delusion. Who shall provide for you if he withholds his sustenance? Nay, but they persist in rebellion and aversion. Who is better guided, he who walks groveling on his face, or he who walks upright on a straight path? Say, he it is who has brought you into being, and has given you hearing and sight, and has given you hearts to think and understand. How seldom do you give thanks! Say, Allah it is who multiplied you in the earth, and to Him you will be mustered. They say, if you are truthful, tell us when will this promise of the hereafter be fulfilled? Say, Allah alone knows about that, and I am no more than a plain warner. When they will see it near at hand, the faces of all those who had denied it will be distraught, and then they will be told, This is the doom which you used to ask for. A to them, Did you ever consider whether Allah destroys me and those that are with me, or shows mercy to us? Who can protect the unbelievers from a grievous chastisement? Say to them, he is merciful, and it is in him that we believe, and it is in him that we put all our trust. Soon will you know who is in manifest error. Say to them, Did you even consider 
If all the water that you have in the wells were to sink down into the depths of the earth, who will produce for you clear flowing water?